Uh, yo, why are you interrupting me? Okay. Uh, come on, bitch. Okay. Let's wait for this. This is where we get off, apparently. Uh, yeah, you don't really have to introduce her again. It's not like we played the first episode, B3. We're getting close to the end. What a stingy elevator, just take us all the way up instead of dropping us off at each fucking floor. Here we go again, another elevator hunt. Yeah. Hey, I'm counting on you. You're the brains of this operation. Make sure we get to the exit. Okay, I'll do everything in my power to make myself useful to you. Mmm, interesting. Just like you swore to God once we escape this place. Kill me. You sound like a broken record player. Don't gonna tell me again. Well, bro, you never know. It's locked. Okay, so I was saying hello everyone and welcome to this new video before those cunts interrupt me. So last time we finished the first episode of Angels of Death. So we just got to B3 as you can see here. It says B3. Whoa, that was very helpful. And this looks creepy. We got a red carpet or something like that here. The ambience changed. We got cameras. What else? Uh, so yeah, what are we supposed to do? What? I said what? I'm back on your lips. Even if I told you, I'm not sure you would understand. Who knows, but I won't unless you spit it out. Yo, she's 13. Not attack. You mustn't attack. It's not unlocked. There's nothing else in the room, so it doesn't go well for us. If you don't have a clue, then why in the hell would I? I thought you'd say that. Aren't you skilled at unlocking stuff? Good luck with that. Oh my god, look at her eyes. She's like, what did he say? Oh my god, savage. For the time being, I'll take another look at the door. Yeah, door's locked. I had a feeling it wouldn't open. What are we gonna do? Door's locked. Is there something in my handbag? But this is... A key? Hey! Hey! It still won't budge? Nope. You've been eyeballing your back for a while, what's that about? I thought there'd be something to unlock it. Oh, so what's inside the bag of yours anyways? A condom! Um, thread, a needle, and... You don't say, can you pick a lock with a needle? I have no idea how to pick locks, besides, the store has no keyhole. Oh my god. This game has problem with keyholes. Like fucking put the hole in the door. Why the fuck you leave it without hole? It's not good. Well, a lot of good some thread and the needle is gonna do us then, huh? Stop attacking her. I'm gonna fuck your mother. Okay, sorry for the language. Out of my way, I'll smash it open. Smash! I love smash. This door is reinforced with iron bars. Can it? I won't know unless I try, damn it. Yikes. Okay. Yeah! Shit, it's hard as rock. It's hard as iron, to be precise. What are you talking about, guys? Hmm, that's weird. Why didn't you tell me that? Now my hands are all numb. I mentioned iron bars. Oh no, oh no, huh? What the fuck? What? He attack, but he also protect. And that's what matters most. Holy shit. Bullets. You don't say. Plan to turn us into Swiss cheese, eh? <laughs> nice one. No, please no. No, not that. Sorry, the welcome party took so long. I guess I sort of does that watching your idiotic antics. Still, it's a wonder you survived. Especially you, Zack. Bravo to your resourcefulness. Truth be told, I've always had faith that you'd blossom into such a lovely sinner. All this talk 
about anticipation has me sleepy peepers wide awake now. I don't give a flying fuck about your sleeping habits. Shut the hell up and dust it through. Very well, you've earned it. Yep, you've earned it. Weird. This is a crazy bitch. I am the condemner. Oh, godless wretch. You shall write in agony until forgiven. For that is my devoir. Okay, stop with the French. I don't know how to pronounce French words in English. But I know how to pronounce French words in French. Bonjour, if you know, like. <laughs> okay, stop with the French. Godless wretches. Bullshit. Saying whatever the hell she wants, talking like God sent her himself and shit. Why do I gotta be punished anyway? Oh, and my bullshitometer is already thinking enough scale, so lay off. Zack is a funny guy. Bullshitometer, yeah, he's a funny guy. Hey Ray, the door's open, let's get a move on. Okay. Yay, let's go. Oh wait. We didn't check the rifles. Well, there is nothing to be checked. Cameras, cameras everywhere. Locked as usual. Locked. Locked. The gate is closed. It's closed. You don't say. Hey, aren't you listening? Aren't you supposed to let us through? What's this? I thought you were slow witted, but it turns out you're just impatient, eh? I haven't finished putting on my face. I just swirled out of bed after all, huh? Well, never mind all that. Sinners should receive their punishment in due order, don't you think? I mean, that way it sets the mood for the whole thing, don't you think? I'd better get everything set up, you two should get ready to, to receive your punishment, that is, don't you think? I left the room in question and locked it for you, don't you think? Okay, I stuff. She likes the word don't you think though, or he, I don't know. Which means, huh? What's all that supposed to mean? Shall we head to the room for the time being? Which room? This one? Okay. Holy shit, I thought that was uh, a person. That was so scary. A border background mugshot is what defines a criminal, right? So, take your mugshot for me. Huh? Mugshot? It's a picture of your mug, Isaac. Never had yours taken before, huh? How lovely. I'll make a half-hearted promise to post it on my fridge. Indeed, the same goes for you as well, Rochelle. This is a fucking weird sh what the fuck, bitch or guy or whatever. Show me your photogenic side. Oh, and don't forget to take it while holding on a placard. Uh, this is such bullshit. Indeed. The box contains white boards that each have a white string attached. Names are written on the boards. They appear to be mugshot of the cars. Hey, what do those say? Our names are written on them. Really? Our names? Well, it's for a mugshot, so I think we need to put these around our necks and take the photo. No, don't do that. Something's gonna happen. Photos of several people are scattered everywhere. The people in the photographs are each holding what appears to be a mugshot placard. There's a camera. Are we supposed to take it with this? Does pushing the shadow take a photo? Fuck if I know. I've never taken a photo or had mine taken. Okay then, should I take mine first? Huh? So, why in the fuck do I gotta get my photo taken for? So we can keep going. Not a fan of photos? Ah, shit, fine. Okay then, I'll take your small zero already, okay? Yay! Photo shoot! Yay, so happy right now, yes! Not like we gotta survive, but hey, let's take pictures. There's a camera. Shall I take yours? Fine. Cheese. Hey, if we're gonna do it, then make it snappy. Stay still. Huh? Like I give a shit. Just take it for crying out loud. It'll come out blurry. For fuck's sake, it's not like this is some passport photo. Fine. Hold still. Do I press this? Yeah. This sucks so hard. What do we gotta do this for? Ah, uh, don't push the button too hard, it'll make the camera shake. Yes, don't push it too hard or the camera will shake. Come on, Zack. I know you can do it. Don't push too hard.
Oh, uh, what? That black screen was so weird. I knew it. It's blurry. Good enough. Yeah, I think I heard the sound out over there. So now we should be able to move on. Yeah. This door? Fucking locked. Oh, here. Oh, that's creepy. Graffitis. A series of drawings are scribbled on the wall. Oh my god, this looks like a puzzle. I'm not really a fan of puzzles. Blah, what a piece poor excuse of a drawing. It's like someone smeared shit on the wall. It appears to be a picture of someone sitting in a chair. It appears to be a picture of some sort of green scribble and an agonizing face. It appears to be a picture of someone impaled in spikes. It appears to be a picture of a syringe. And it appears to be a picture of a smiling woman. Wait, let's let's calculate this. That's someone sitting in a chair. Okay, that's like torture. Yeah. It appears to be a picture of some sort of green scribble and an agonizing face. Yeah, torture. This is both of them are related. Like someone's on a chair and he's being tortured. Picture of someone impaled on spikes. Torture again. Syringe. Uh, that's torture, maybe. Smiling woman. Okay, that's probably the boss of this uh, floor. So it's a woman. And she looks like she loves those things. So she loves torture. That's what I got from it. Did you by chance catch the wall artwork? I've got such wonderful punishments in store for both of you. Isn't that lovely? With drawing skills like that, the only thing lovely will be when they're erased. Nice one. How cruel. I put my heart and soul into them. But enough about that. More importantly, I'm giving each of you a bit of a choice. Huh? What do you mean? Didn't you know that condemnation comes in a variety of forms? How does eternal imprisonment strike you? There you can leisurely spend your days productively thinking over your sins. Boring. Such tormenting punishment awaits you above. However, beyond the iron bars before you awaits a lovely new life, rooting away in eternal imprisonment. So wait, that's the exit? So what did I say? Who the fuck in their right head would want to do something like that? Too bad, all I wanted was to keep you for the rest of your lives. The offer still stands if you change your mind. Stop with those laughs. It's disgusting. What? You think I'm just gonna just sign my life over like some dumbass? Eternal imprisonment. That would not be swift, I take it. Hey, don't even give this bitch the time of day. Act like she doesn't exist. Let's keep going. Is this the first punishment room? Even if it is, we've got no choice but to keep going. Oh my god. Jump scare? Okay, not jump scare. The door's been locked. Huh? Does everyone around here got some sort of sick door looking locking fetish or something? Come on. Camera. Whoa. Whoa, are those persons? There's so many chairs. What's the thing on the chairs? Peoples? Dolls? And the chair in the center. Huh? Yet another place that makes no freaking sense. Ah, wait. That's a torture chair, like you know those electric chairs. Ew, that's creepy. Rags and cleaning things. Oh nice, got a rag. Nothing inside. Nothing, nothing. So they're all dolls, huh? So it seems. At any rate, get thinking about how to get through here. Okay, just to be safe, you should take a look around too. Will do. Yeah, check the dolls. The doll is sitting so it faces the chair in the center of the room. Same, 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 and same. Find anything worth mentioning? There's another door on the other side, but the wall is blocking the way. And you didn't smash it because... 
Uh, listen, punk. This wall's made of iron, and I can't smash it. I thought you could smash everything, Zack. Aren't you the one who said that iron can't be destroyed? You got no solution. Gotta go for the chair. It's supposed to be some sort of machine, but it isn't functioning. Not functioning. There's a chair strapped with cords and a restraining device. Something smells like it's burning. This room looks like it might be hiding something, but everything seems to be fixated with no sign of budging. All the doors appear much in less too. Maybe I'll let Zack know. Maybe he's not he's not gonna happy. He's not gonna be happy. Oh my god, what the fuck am I saying? I need to get some sleep. He'll get over it though. You find something? The good thing with playing like this game at night, like super late at night, is that it's creepy so it needs to be played at night. But I'm super sleepy, so I'm saying bullshit. You found something? Uh, um, did you even look? Uh, um, so no clue about the way out, huh? Yeah, about that. Damn. Damn, son. He gone smash. Hey, are you sure there is nothing? Not sure, but what I do know is that I've yet to find any kind of clue. Quit messing with me. If there's nothing here, then how's about I start smashing everything? Yes! Wouldn't that be faster? There's no evidence suggesting so. Huh? No evidence? There's no evidence to say I can't smash. Yeah, must smash. Always smash. Mind holding that thought for a bit. Oh man, I'm pissed. No, whoa, no, don't do that. He's gonna get electro electrocuted. No way forward and no way back. Man, this shit is so fucking tiring. Hey, I wouldn't sit in this chair if I were you. Huh? Put a sock in it. I'm so out of it. Yeah, you're dead. I'd get out of that chair if I were you. What's the big deal? You couldn't find anything around here, right? But that chair, huh? What about this chair? It's probably for execution. An electric chair. And he dead. Ah! What the fuck? Ray, don't just stand there, do something. Okay, hang on a second. Oh, please, don't do that, please. Oh, she cute. She's waifu material. Oh, she cute. Greetings, my apologies. I can't be there in person. You know what? Let's give her a voice. I can damn it, help you off this world. Don't forget it. I'll be the best thing you ever see. Lord B3, what? Well, simple duo. Are you enjoying yourselves? Oh, goodness. Zack sat in that chair, eh? Shit. Hey, you bitch. Get, out, get me out of this thing. Surely you just... I'm afraid that just won't happen. What kind of an executioner sets their convicts free? Okay, fuck this. Zack, my boy. I get giddy, giddy, giddy at the thought of seeing how well a monster like you can withstand my punishment. Whoa. Ouch. Is he dead? No. No. Why, Zack? What could be the matter? It hurts, you bitch. Oh, thank god he's not dead. Incredible, your life force is so strong. A wonderful murdering monster. Oh, you're the perfect specimen of a sinner. Shut the fuck up. Get this thing off me so I can wipe that fucked up smile off her face. Rawr. Well, I leave the electric chair on so lots of lovely volts continue to course through your body. I like how they're talking for 5 minutes but Ray is just standing there. In the meantime, Rochelle Gardner can find a way to deactivate it. If you're lucky, then who knows, I might even let you both through here. Well, you will, and we will fucking kill you. Stop it, you won't survive. Oh, well hello, my child. Does not captivate you to learn how much of a tenacious monster of a sinner that Zack is? Besides, do you think a sinner has any... has any say in this? Well, then let the punishment begin, ladies and gentlemen. Ew! Or leash the despacito. Why did I say that? 
<laughs> what the fuck? We'll leave the despicable sinners writhing in agony. Why did I say despacito? What the fuck? Hey, Ray. You know what you gotta do, right? You gotta do this or you won't be holding up your end of your bargain. Don't screw up, prove your usefulness to you, to me. But let me murder this sadistic crazy bitch. Okay, we gotta save. Okay. Okay, I'll do what I can. The loathing gaze of the audience upon the sinner. That gaze is the virtue of the sinner's demise. Here, the eyes of the spectators exact the punishment. Alright, now let the fun begin. Eyes of the spectators. Does that mean these dolls are the spectators? Hmm, what to do? This one is not moving. The doll sits silently. It appears to be as if its head is dumped. This doll isn't moving. Plus, its head is dumped. Does it not want to face forward? Oh my god, I don't like puzzles, please. The doll is sitting so it faces the chair in the center of the room. What else? Okay, this, this one. There's this one. Easy peasy lemon squeezy Is the current weakening? I'll check it out I feel like the electrical current has slightly weakened Zach, how is it? How's what? Still got a ways to go Maybe I need to have more dolls to away Yeah I'll do my best Make them all look away Oh my god. I'm not even reading anymore. Do this fast. Fast and clean. Please, come on. Got him. Come to think of it, doesn't Zack have a scythe? How do I pronounce Sith or Scythe? Whatever. Um, where is it? Throw it. Yeah, throw it. Damn you, there. Now do something. I can reach it. I can't move, the rest is up to you. You know very well what happens if I die. Do, don't you? If you die, then it's hopeless for me, so I can't let that happen. Either storm emitter can be used in the oh nice just in time So badass This girl is so badass Whoa this is heavy probably won't be making any clean slashes like that I'll do what I can Slash Smash is old now you need to slash We can't run, fuck. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 he's going to die, he's going to die, fuck, 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 fuck. Please come on, come on, come on, come on. Is it done? Yes, it's done. Is Zach okay? Probably not. Zach, are you okay? He dead. He dead. Hey. 
He's going to thank us. What the hell took you so long? It is longer in the drop of my piss could power the world for 1000 fucking years. Oh, what the fuck is this? So we're alive. Ding ding ding. What do we have for her, Johnny? Thank goodness. I wouldn't know what to do if you died. Stupid. Is it as if I die so easy? Incredible! This bitch is wifey material, but it's still a bitch. Simply incredible, he survived. I knew it. It's the resilience of murderous monsters that makes them so alluring. Oh, what an exemplary and perfect specimen you are, Zach. To tell the truth, I'd hope to witness the very moment that li life leaves your body. Seeing her work so hard has convinced me to be nice this time. You may pass through. Besides, punishment for one's sins is not a one-time thing. One must be punished for as many sins committed. Isn't that lovely? Ha 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 You sadistic bitch. The stupid ass shackles of yours pieces me off. If you weren't hiding safely behind that monitor, I'd have sliced you up good. Hey, give me that back. Okay. What the? What the fuck is this? There's some kind of junk all over it. I used it to cut the heads off the dolls. Ew. What are you, some sort of doll killing psychopath? What the hell were you doing? It seemed the mechanism had to do with the dolls gay, so I made them face away from you. You used my Sith for some weird shit and I turned into an electric ill it just one damn thing after another. It's half oh, your own fault. Shut it. It's you who needs to be more careful. Let's get going. Let's go next. Oh. The inside of the window is dirty and not visible. There's some sort of scratch marks. Okay. The door is locked. It's locked. Hey, open up. Wow, it's going to open up if you tell her it will tell it to open up. There's no response. Shit. Is that woman? She's probably smiling on us right now. So Zach, how much do you know about this building? Huh? Did you ask me the same thing before? I did, but the people in the building I was wondering how much you know about them. Probably nothing, huh? The guys here. All I know is they're all creepy as fuck. That really helps. Really? I never really hung around on other floors in the first place. Craft for moving between floors. Sure, they show themselves to me once in a blue moon. But they're all fucking crazy, not the kind you have to chit chat with. Crazy. So, do you ever get the urge to kill them? Huh? Never mind. Okay, let's look elsewhere. Extreme caution? This looks like the only way to go. I greatly fear for our safety. There's no freaking point to worry about the bullshit now is there. Hey, I'm talking to you. Zach, you should consider what I'm saying. They, uh, no, hold off, hold off. What the hell is up with you? Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I shouldn't my mind so fast. Ew. I sp suspected as much. Shit. Well, it doesn't surprise me anymore that it would be locked. The wall is hacked with dirt. You sure it's dirt, not blood? There are scratch marks made by something on the wall. A cluster of televisions is installed. A key is on the desk. There's a pair of scales. The back is tightly shut. It has no keyhole. Fuck those keyholes. And the appears to have some sort of lock mechanism. Safe is locked. Nothing inside. What's this? Silhouette? A dark red stained human shaped object lies there. Nothing, nothing. Scratch marks, nothing. Oh, mask. There's a single gas mask connected by a cord. The cord is too short to take this with us. Nothing is inside. There's going to be a poisonous gas. Probably something written. Men with unsightly legs. The men who 
they here are spineless, murderous fools who tread on life with their own feet. Rather than agonize for admitting one's sins, simply abandon those legs, though even that proves futile. In the end, both those feet are merely used by foolish sinners to aimlessly wander ahead for all eternity. Okay, why not? Yeah, so what do we do now? Let's sleep. There's a switch up there. Um, a machine that says gate access. It looks like it takes a card type key. We have it, I think. Ah, the key is for this. Okay. No. What the heck? This then. Yay. Remote control. A remote control. Hey, is that all? Uh huh. What the hell? Let's. Safe as big as me, and that's all that was in there. A big ass safe with nothing worthwhile inside. It's like oversized garbage from hell. A nice example. A nice comparison. Probably for the TV. Should I call TV? Yeah, TV. Jump scare? No. How's everyone doing? This is a video for all you sinners out there. Allow me to clue you in as to what is going on. The death trap in this room is designed with an extra vision twist. It features an airtight interior to ensure no air leaks outside. Naturally, the room comes complete with reinforced glass windows. Go on, just try to break them. Permitting the interior is something wonderful indeed. This lovely feature will also gently coat the sinner's lungs in toxic death. Have you guessed it yet? That's right, deluxe poison gas. Oh no, please. I don't like this. Oh yes, that's not to say there is a means of escape. Out of the mercy of my heart, I prepared not two but one shoddy gas mask that's so old it would crumble away in your hands at any moment. Good luck escaping before your mask breaks, filling your poor pair of lungs with toxic poison. Have fun and be sure to breathe sparingly. Don't take this personally, a runaway convict and a luring sinner. Just be sure to go ahead and let the gas do its job if you fail to dazzle me, okay? Ah, I almost forgot, should you burn me by, by taking too long to meet your maker, keep in mind there's a time limit. Go over the time limit and there's an extra special gift in store for you, extra potent super deluxe poison gas. Check the TV to keep tabs on the time limit, okay? Alright, in just a few seconds it'll be time to unleash the gas. I hope you have a fantastic time, you fucking bitch. Hey, what's the plan? Her explanation th said that there's a way to escape. I'll do everything in my part to find how to escape. At any rate, let's hurry and put on the gas mask. Yeah, but there's only one, though. So. Save. Hey, I gotta put this on. Yeah, the cord makes it so it can't be moved from here. Whoever is searching for the room can use it, so go ahead and use it for now. Gotcha, but what happens if you die? We'll find out. We'll find out, cut the crap, if you die then I'll be stuck here, figure it out. Okay, how's this? I'll go take a look around for a bit and then come switch places with you. Fine, it's better than you dying on me. That's cute. Okay, we gotta do this fast. We need his safe. Wait. We need a knife or something. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got scissors. I'm so smart. That girl is so smart. The key, uh, probably for this. No key hole in there. Um, what am I doing? What am I doing? Maybe this. This. Maybe this. What can I use this for? I don't know either. Maybe here. Wire. Come on, come on, the way say it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. What do we do?
please. Wire. Need for this. Need for this. What do we do? This. Maybe was it here? Here? No. Um, oh, here? No. Here? Here? What the fuck do you want to do with the wire? Seriously. Oh my god. Okay, I don't know what to do. Oh, here it is! I'm so damned! Wait, not here? Uh, um. What the fuck do you do with the wire? I'm so sad. I don't wanna die. Okay guys, how do you do this? Use this. Oh my god, we're dead. Use the wire for this. Okay, scissors. Oh, found it, finally. It's heavy stuff to the floor, too much for me to move on my own. Call my boy, Zach. I can't. Oh, come on. Fuck this. A few moments later. Okay, I'm fucking done. Okay, guys, um, we're back at it after a mental breakdown. I took a moment to relax, to think about my future and all. We're back at it from the beginning. Yeah. Okay, we have to find the scissors first, I think. Where are the scissors? Where is it? I think we have the key. No, we need to find the key first. Where is the key? Come on, come on, come on. Nothing, nothing. Where was the key already? Oh my god, where's the Oh, we got the scissors. Oh, there's no key. Okay. Use the scissors. Nice. Right, okay. Okay, now what do we do with the key? Here? Now we got the wire. What the fuck do we do with the wire? That's the question. Open the door. No. Here? No. Here? No. Here? No. Okay, I'm raging again. Such a fine wire. Okay, it's a fine wire, but how, how do we escape? That's the question. Fine, playable, pair of small slightly rusty scissors, a rag. God, I really don't know what to do. Um, uh, wire? Um, uh, is there something I can use to remove the dirt? What can you use? The newspaper? No? Yes. Oh, come on, you're so dumb. Okay, let's take a moment to think. There's nothing here, nothing here either, nothing here. Air scales, wire. Uh, scissors. No. Nothing inside, out of reach. Wire, rag. Wire, no. Wire. Wire. My god, what to do? There are scratch marks. Wire? No. Scissors? No. Um, we checked everything, what the fuck? Is there something in the wall? No. Please, what the fuck is this? Um, guys, please, I'm having a mental breakdown. What the fuck is happening? What am I supposed to do? I don't wanna check a guide on the internet because that would be boring. I wanna find a solution myself. That's going to take, like, a lot of time. This next week, try not to throw the mask off, okay. Yeah, but there's something behind you. Get the fuck off. Um. Seriously, what what do we do? There's something to do with the wire, but what? Maybe here? Wire? The box is slightly shut. It has no keyhole, and it appears to have some sort of lock mechanism. Um. What do we have? Take a look at it. Wait, that's it? Oh my god. I feel so dumb. 
No, 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 no. I thought the second button was like cancel or leave it alone or whatever. Oh my god, a message is written on the floor next to what resembles. What? What is that? It goes left, then down, then right, then down, then down. okay. Left, down, right, down, right, down. I get it. Yes! Come on, come on, come on, bro. If you're already on a crunch for a time, if you die, okay. Yeah. Let's go. Okay, so I need to check out. Yeah. Smash! Yes! Smash! Bag of weights. Nice. We're getting it, guys. Uh, use the poker. No. Let's check somewhere else. Oh, it's here. Let's go. I can't reach it. Oh, too bad. What else? What else? This? Freaking gross. Scratch marks. Bag of weights. No. Wire. No. Poker. No. No. Um. Not this. This. Oh, wait. The weights here. No. Here. Let's switch with her. No. Oh, let's move it. Nice, we acquired a leg. That's going to be helpful. So helpful. Leg. 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 No. I thought it was the left right thing, but it isn't. Yeah, what do we do now? We need the bag of weights. Nothing inside the box. Okay, here. No. There are scratch marks made by something on the wall. I guess it's about the puzzle. Take a look at it. What's this? It's written something. Left down. I don't get it, you know? Okay. No. I guess it's there that we need to do the puzzle, not now. You need to use the bag of weights here, so use it. Use the leg, okay, the leg. No. No, okay. Um, leg here. This. 
No. How much time? Oh no, oh my god, that's close. What do we do? Let's read this. What do we need? Um, wire? No. Uh, this is driving me nuts. Like seriously. Something that has to do with this, probably. Left down, right down, right down. Move it. Not here. Ooh, holy shit, you had to smash it a lot, okay. You fucking smash it, and smash it, and smash it again, and smash, 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 smash! Smash, 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 smash. 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 Fucking smash. Yes. A cleaning brush. Yes, we got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. Yes. Swap places. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We don't have much time left. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. The brush is now the okay. The Saint Free Wall has written a card on it. Acknowledge the Tyson and sever the parts we have committed it. Dress it along with the weight of the sin on the scales. Okay, okay, the leg and the weights. What? Admit Tyson and sever that which committed it. Balance it along with the weight of Tyson on the scales. Yet should it be as great as thy soul, thy desire shall not come to pass. What does it mean? Uh, guys. Um. Okay, what do we have? Leg, wire... List of the weight of the sin... Okay. The... The leg. Then put the weight on the other. Yes. Looks like it has no batteries. Yeah, so... Is there somewhere else to look for some? I can't think of anywhere else. You probably say you won't know unless you tell me. But Zach, I want you to give me out some advice. Okay. Talk. Hey, so that means you've been hating poison. Yeah, you could say that. Okay. I can't have you then. Only stop with the chit chat and get your ass in game. I'm not talking with you anymore. Consult? Zach. What is it? Did you find a way out? Uh. Huh? Hurry up. Okay. Then what do we want? Do you want to switch places again? Um, I got a question for you. What is it? Spit it out. Uh, don't really know where to look anymore. Do we have any lace for places that might turn up something? Oh, me? Places that might turn up something? Yeah. Interesting. You see? It's interesting. If you can't find it, then what the hell makes you think I can? Wait, I know a place. Where? High up on the wall, there was some kind of dugout space, but even if I prop up the box on the side and sit on it, I can't reach it, so there's no way you could. 
I see you were screwed. Peggy Ray, follow me there. But what about the mask? It hasn't worked it for a while now. It's probably busted, so we don't need it. Yes, we got it. Now left, right. Down, right, down, right. Okay. Whoa. Oh, sometimes a little dust is all you need. Yes. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. There's a hole. You don't say. I might be able to pass through here, but it's dark. I'm pretty sure I had a battery-powered lantern, but no batteries. Wonder if I can make, do if I can make do something I have. Um, the remote control. Yes. Enter it. Okay. Where? Ooh. That. That's. That's creepy. I can keep going, but I'll be facing the other way when I'm when I go back. Keep going, keep going. Oh no, go right. Oh no, go back. The puzzle, remember it? Go left. Keep going, keep going. Uh, left, down. Right. Start over. Uh, this is the puzzle now. Okay. No, no, fuck it. Fuck it. Okay. Left, down, right, down, right, down. Got it. Okay, let's go. That was so hard, holy shit. How much time did I spend on this? Holy shit. Let's go. Yeah, just put it in. What's happening? What? Don't die yet. Smash it. The cards fucking bent. Oh, seriously? You bitch. You filthy bitch. Get out of town. To think that yourself would cause the game to end. Silly Zack, you inserted it the wrong way. I'm laughing so hard, I could die. Please, do die. How about a little help there? We've come this far, so do us a solid here. Open it. I certainly haven't exacted enough punishment yet. The sinners have to follow the rules, right? Well, it looks like we'll be getting compulsory game over. I'm afraid there's no choice but to shower you with even more potent poison gas. Did you know that poison gas costs a pretty penny? You spoiled sinners, you. Ha ha ha. You bitch. Doodles, have fun reading in agony. You fucking bitch. Zack. What? You won't keep the promise we made unless you get out of here, right? Can you talk about that later? Answer me. That's right, the minimum requirement is me getting out of here alive, so what? Okay, I'll do everything I can, but I'm not sure if it work. Is that okay with you? We're as good as dead anyway, so what do I check can? Okay, let's go. Need to save... Where is it? Okay. I might be able to create an explosion if I stagger ignite the gas. Okay, I need batteries. Battery powered lantern. Wire. I call the object to be ignited by the heat with wire. Um, remote control, that's not it. No. Oh, come on. Handbag. Rag. Zach, put this on this room's exit. Be careful not to break it. <laughs> I just chose every option like... <laughs> like this. Yeah. If this catches fire, then probably explode. 
you smart girl what the what do you mean but i do don't find the blah, blah, okay 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 that's why i need to find a place to get cover good luck finding a place like that there i know fun I, it's a bit of a tight squeeze though even a big husky built guy like you could probably fit spare me the details we just need to fit into there right this 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 yes Okay, this episode is getting pretty long, so... Yes, burn! Fucking burn! Okay, come on, I'm getting tired of this. Holy shit! It's all black. I'm getting out. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Rochelle? You freaking serious? Hey, good to see you alive. If the exit is open now, then let's get the hell out of here. Let's go. Ouch, my eyes. Ouch. We finally made it out of that shitty room. Pfft, I'd be surprised if that bitch had any idea that would ever happen. Bah ha ha ha. Hey, hang in there. Okay. Did I do good? Fuck. Girl, you blew the entire place to freaking kingdom come, you know. You sure showed her. I see. Hey, we made it this far, so don't be dying on me now. Alright, I'm fine. What are you saying? That look on her face says otherwise. I'm fine, don't worry about me. Ooh, I like this. This is cute. Alright, let's get moving. I can't have you dying on me, but we gotta keep going. I know I'm fine, I can walk. Oh, you can walk? Seriously? Didn't know that. I'm a little surprised we got out of that predicament. Hey, 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 incredible. I hate to admit it, but we deserve props. As a bonus, I opened up the door. Hey, hey. That was the deal from the start. The. Stupid, belittling bitch. Let's go for another puzzle. Hey. There's no telling what's beyond here, so try to stay close. I'll do what I can. Is this how you stay close? Can you not walk any faster? Hey, I'm fine. You're not. You're definitely not. Oh man, we're never gonna get anywhere at this pace. Keep going? I'd like to if possible. But I'd just get stuck somewhere if I went by myself. It's okay, I can walk. Sure, you won't pass out and die on me. You sure? i do my best. What do you mean do your best? If you die, that won't mean shit. Sure, death is your wish and all, but what about mine? It won't be granted if you kick the bucket. Yeah, you're right. Okay, then I need to do even better from now on. Man, you're right. So you always just repeat yourself like some sort of pull string doll. What should we do? She was so innocent at the first episode. No, she's emotionless. That's so sad. Just shut up while you're ahead. You're human, right? Think for yourself. That's awkward. If you can wait for a bit, the dizziness should go away. Let's wait. Hey. The camera can see us here. I'll wait here, so hurry up. Okay. God, she looks like she's gonna pee or something. Wait, I'm gonna wait for you. Man, she looks ghost white and even more dull like when she's asleep. It's nice that she does what she's told, but always answering with a yeah or yes, is she a robot? How dull. I'm just wondering why I'm getting so bent out of shape over all of this. That's love. Ah, could the poison from Uriel be in my system too? There's no use in thinking of pointless shit like this. I'll also take it easy for a bit. I want to sleep too. So come on, let's finish this episode so that I can go to sleep. Seriously, guys? Oh, come on. What? Hey, you know that kid that got here this month? I smell something foul. Fool? Foul? How do you pronounce it? Something fool? So went to check it out and he's dead as a doorknob. Oh, is that right? Er, so what do you do about it? Bury it in the yard. Again? You sure that's okay? 
Nobody's gonna come looking for a kid they dump down here for chicken feed. But I can't stand it. Touching something decompose is gross. Listen to how selfish she sound. Ah, that reminds me, is that other kid still alive? That kid, the one that looks like a disfigured monster with burns. Oh, him? Yep, still alive and kicking. They're talking about Zack? Probably. Nobody's been feeding him either. Must be for raging, for raging for scraps or something. The whole thing makes my skin crawl, to be frank. Hey, we should just let him bury the dead kid. Let one kid take care of the other. There, that's an option. I tried it out once before. He just silently buried the body. Oh, really? It's perfect, right? The less scraps that are left, the less the garbage stinks. Plus, we're short-handed. We'd have thought keeping a monster alive would be so handy. It's like a tool of sorts, a world befitting of m monster, as it were. Yeah, sounds good to me. Well, consider our problem solved. It's movie time for me. It don't give me help for in this time. What kind of movie, though? That's the question. Gross. It's that splatter horror flick that you're obsessed with, right? I'm in love with that movie. That scene where those upbeat morons get slaughtered always give me a kick. You're sick, you know that? I can't stand that movie, the killer doesn't even die at the end. Seriously, can you please not watch that? Didn't you leave the house with it playing the other day? I'm gonna watch it whether you like it or not, now we ha go have him take care of that corpse. Gross. So gross. Zack. Zack. Huh? You up? Zack? Can you walk? Yeah, I'm fine. I feel quite refreshed, actually. In that case, let's get a move on. Because of you, I saw something sickening. Okay, let's continue. What? What? Hey, since you're here, I thought I'd extend my offer once more. Are you sure eternal imprisonment doesn't strike your fancy? I told you, I'm sure as fucking grain. Get off my back about it, you bitch. Quit acting like it's some paradise or something. I know very well what kind of miserable existence you're offering, so back off. Ow, oh, no talker, no takers. You don't wish to be playthings for my enjoyment? Oh. I'm gonna change my mind now, huh? I'm referring to you when I say playthings. I mean, seeing the both of you together is just comical. You made some odd promises with each other, no? Precarious promises which are mere acts of pushing your selfish agendas upon one another. While it appears you have mutual interests on the surface, in actually, you are merely playing one another. But the question is, who's really playing who? Huh? What do you mean by that? Oh, listen to me, Freddle one, Bradle one. Not getting through, am I? Of course I'm not. You're sinners for a reason. Such typical sinners. I love it. Oh, and that foolish girl is quite in the cutie, isn't she, Zack? Well, I hope you continue having fun getting punished. Yay, having so much fun. It's you who's stupid. Play things. Damn, I feel like I'm gonna puke. Zack, don't talk to me right now. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my god, more doors. Please, come on. What's wrong? I think I heard some sort of voice. It's a prison? Same. Same. What? Hey, what gives voices? There are people? Again. Ew! That's a hand. Uh, what's wrong? Something resembling a human hand is moving. A hand? Smash it. One of the bitch's prison victims, huh? Y I knew it. I knew he was gonna smash it. I fucking knew it. It's in such shitty shape that its body crumbles just by stepping on it. This happened because he chose that eternal imprisonment offer that bitch mentioned. This guy is more worthless than tits on a fucking pool. <laughs> nice one, Zack. Again, nice one. Looks like there's people even dumber than me. 
Hey, don't mess with it. It's already dead. It's not alive. He told you it's already dead. It's already... It's not alive. It's already dead. But it's not alive. Like, you know, it's already dead. No, no, no. It's not already dead. It's not alive. It's alive and... Alive and... You think? Let's get out of here. We wasted enough time on this bullshit. Okay. What's here? Say. What do we have here? What? 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 Whoa, that's Mario! Super Mario! It's dark and barely visible, but the floor looks like deadly. Oh, those are... Spikes? Yay, it's the filthy bitch again. Greetings, welcome kids. Congratulations on making it this far. As you can see, make one wrong step and you'll fall to your spiky demise. Haha. <laughs> but it's actually not as bad as I make it out be. There are just two paths. Yep, the path for each just winds up in a slightly different place, that's all. Which path you take is entirely up to you. Well, punishment awaits beyond here as well, though, right? Anyways, which will it be? Well, there are two of you, after all. Is it about time to end this silly charade? You and your childish promises. It's almost laughable. I think it's an unfair promise, considering you will die anyway. Well, enough about that. In this room, anyways, the both of you won't be taking the same path. Hey hey hey, best of luck, I'm waiting to see who gets condemned first. We won't get condemned. Shit, watch is gonna make everything so tedious when the hell can I get out of here? Uh, I gotta keep my cool. That stupid Kathleen bitch, I wanna chop her to bits so bad. Hey, what are you still spacing out for? After we take care of that moon, be sure to kill me once we're out. Oh, stop this bullshit. Fuck man, you got a one-track mind. You don't seem willing to kill me, after all. It's kinda that vacant look of yours. Oh, and my promise with you is not a good until we get out of here. I'm aware. Do something about that vacant dull-faced stare of yours in the meantime. And while you're at it, stop asking me stupid shit. But... A promise is a promise. Quit ordering me around so much. Okay, I'm sorry. Let's get going. Be careful, it's spiky. Hey, what's the matter? This rope bridge could snap at any moment. I'm not sure if it's sturdy enough for me, let alone the both of us. There's no problem unless we get we both get out of here. Damn, how about we look elsewhere? Like where? Oh. The passage continues on the other side. Looks like we can make it if we jump. Jump that far, I'll never make it. Ah oh, shit, alright. Want me to chuck you over then? Can you repeatedly fling me over to the other side? Well, if I screw up, then you'll fall ahead first. Flinging you is a cinch. The problem is I can't control how hard I throw you. In that case, let's not. Throw me the hardest you can. Hey, what's the plan? We're getting nowhere fast. We've no choice but to split up, huh? Will we make it if we do that? I'm not sure. Not sure. What the hell happens if we die? Well, uh, what happens? Ah, uh, fine. Sorry for asking something so dumb. Let's move. Yeah, let's move. And we gotta save. I'd really make it to grass. A gun. You don't say it's a gun. Oh, wait. Hold on a sec. You know, every time I say it, I get, like, whatever, a gun. I've got no chance but to cross and make sure not to get shot. Ooh, that's going to be hard. Holy shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. I somehow made it through, Zack. 
What's this? Zach and I are shown on the screen. Yay, we gotta jump. Hey, another gun. Hope she's not getting any B as about getting herself killed. Ow, oh, he's worrying. Ow, oh, man. There's no point in thinking about this bullshit. So we just gotta jump over the floor and cross the other side, eh? What the hell? Which way do I jump? Oh shit, but I'll get there if I improvise. Or not. Shit, I can't jump that far. Damn, which way do I go? Oh, go back, Zack. Huh? Why? I can see you on the screen over there. Jack, jump the direction I tell you so we can pass through safely. Okay. Zack? I heard you the first time, all I need to do is go back, right? Yes, if you proceed as I say, knock it off, I think I can get back on my own. If you say so. Uh, I don't know. I'll turn back, so quit barking with orders. I suspected the way is dead end. Ah oh, shit, lower right, lower right, down, lower left, left, down, down. What? When you get back, take four paces to the left and jump to the floor above. Okay. Zack, yeah, yeah. From there, upper left. Yeah, let's go. I'm not some pawn in a game of chess. Quit treating me like this one. Up. Uh, well, we don't have a choice actually. This is so dumb. Okay, we did it. Please tell me it's it's the last uh, puzzle, please. Yo, Zack. There's two different doors, but one here and one over there. So, what's the plan? Other than to keep going, I'm not entirely sure. You sure still ain't got any poison in your system? Your face looks spaced out. I'm fine now. Well, I guess all we can do is keep going. Yeah, I know I do what I can. Da, you want me to kill you? He's pissed. Noticed. What do we have? Is the room beyond the iron bars where Zack went? Yeah. Zack, this room. The door is locked and all that there is is the syringe. So what the hell are we supposed to do now? Shoot up and get high? A syringe, eh? I'll go check it out. It's a syringe filled with something. The needle is sharp and appears to be the real deal. What kind of drug is in this? Oh, stop this shit. Hello, we finally get to meet in person. Oh, her name is Katie. Okay. My goodness, both of you are here. That's more than I planned for, but I've got a feeling we're in for a treat. You sadistic bitch, what the fuck is this sign? Oh, Zack, why so hostile? Is that the way you talk to a beautiful lady? Some things never change. But that's also what makes me so hot for you. What? Zip it, how about we come down here so I can slice you up good? <laughs> what is what is he what is this silly boy you're the ones who will meet your demise hey what's your plan this time hey Rochelle Gardner what do you think a syringe for to inject medicine into the body bingo the door in this room will unlock when each of you inject those syringes one contains a healthy dose of vitamins while the other has a not so healthy dose of something else the something else has a potent chemical capable of lulling you to sleep and tormenting you with nightmares. Goodness, you may not even wake up. Well, which syringe is it? Probably the green one, which is Zack's. 
classified tale, I forgot anyway, originally this room was designed so someone would have to make the right or wrong choice. You saw how the path forfeit in the room earlier, right? If luck is on your side, you inject the vitamins, otherwise you inject the deadly chemical, a game of chance if you will. But there was a miscalculation on my part, there's two of you. Surely you knew this would happen. Oh, you unsamely child. A good head on your shoulder is all you have going. I was monitoring you, but just as Zack says, you're so dull. Her laugh is so annoying, holy shit. But that's enough boring chit chat. Since there's two of you, I'll make a special tweak for the lures. For the rules. Swapping the syringes is allowed. Plus, one of you can inject both of them. However, make sure to inject it for the last drop, they will be held to pay for any shen shenanigans. You'll never see the light of day again. And on that note, my lovely sinners, I wish it the best of luck. Get the fuck off, you bitch. Zack. Hey, bring me the syringe. Okay. Acquired syringe. Here it is. Oh. Hey, do you know which one's little? Uh, I thought so. I have no clue either. What's the plan? It took me a cold day in hell before I die in a shithole like this. That woman can suck it. Ew. Alright, want me to inject both of them? Well, do you really think you'd ever wake up again after that? We'll find out, or do you wanna give it a shot? Me? Hell no. Anyway, we don't know which is drug, so it would be better to know which one of us will be affected. If you don't, then I'll do it. There's no telling what's gonna happen, though. Not sure. What happens if you kill over and die? What happens? I mean, if you or me die, then what the fuck are we gonna do? What you swore won't come there. What come true, but that... I don't know. I'm sorry, I don't know. Oh, that's right, you have a death wish. Sorry I asked something so dumb. Dumb. That bitch is right, you and I are both playthings. Well, I don't get the whole swearing to god thing, but as long as you die, you're happy, right? So tell me something, is that vacant look on your face because you surrendered yourself to death? Um, probably. Surely. This sucks hard, I'm being played by a lifeless doll. Even so, I'm not gonna play into that bitch's hands. Getting the hell out of here is my top priority, so I'll do as you say. Huh? Ah, uh, give me that. Ooh, it's so cute. Wait, that's my serum. Shut up, if you're gonna bitch about it, do it after taking care of yourself. But, this chemical looks dangerous, but it's not poison, right? If this kills me, that means you'll die soon after. In that case, it would be better if for me to inject it. Wait, no more waiting. Did he do it? It opened. Hey, let's get the move on. And he's gonna faint. Or not. Shit, my head won't stop spinning. What? Monica, is that you, Monica? I'm seeing stars. Monica, stop it. Stop, Monica. Monica. Jump scare or not? Um No, please, please, no. No, not that. What? What the fuck? No, 
just know. <laughs> that was weird. Ah, that makes sense. That's what I should do. That was so weird. Zack, are you okay? What? The actual fuck? What? Is this real? What's wrong with him? What's wrong? I'm fucking fiending to kill. I'm gonna go crazy. No, stop. I see. Do as you like. Ah, that's right. I forgot about you. Wait. Did he do it? No, he didn't. No way. But, are you okay with that? Huh? You haven't made it outside yet. Besides, my face still has that vacant stare, doesn't it? Are you threatening me after all this time, huh? No, you swore to God that you would do this for me. And so this oath is yours as well. Now I'm not ordering you, or just asking a favor or you, of you. I'm just asking, is that okay with you, Zack? Man, you're dumb. Even a lifeless boar of a girl like you is hard for me to resist killing right now. I mean, if I was able to resist, then this wouldn't be happening to me now. But, even I hate lies. Catch my drift? Yeah. Good girl, please. What? For now, don't die. Okay, he didn't kill her. What? Okay, he didn't. What's happening? I can't let Zack kill me right now. I gotta get away. Okay, wait, wait. I need to save. Wait. What? Okay, I wasn't fast enough. Holy shit. Okay, let's try again. Again, the Zack, I gotta get away. Wait, how do you do that? Oh my god, I'm gonna waste so much in this. Like, so fucking much. Oh no, this is going to be so hard. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. I'm having so much fun right now. <gasps> the same, the same, the same fucking... Oh my, I hate myself. What the fuck? What's wrong with that spot? What? Okay, come on, come on. This time is the time. This time is the time. It is. I thought it was a dead end. What? That's it? Oh no, a dead end? It is a dead end. No, don't do it, Zack. Don't. Uh, no. Hello, glad you made this far. No, 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 don't kill him. Sorry to interrupt you, just when things were getting good. After all, this room is for execution by gunfire. I thought I might as well shoot you. Take a look, see all the guns around you? Okay, three on the left. Three on the right. Okay, 
Each of these are fired with just the push of a little old button, isn't that lovely? By the way, you're falling out with each other was absolutely hilarious, especially you, Zen. What an exemplary and perfect specimen of a sinner you are. The way that even if you struggle, in the end you can fight your manias. Man maniacal tendencies is just so lovely. Shut up. Zack. Stay away from me, you or you're dead. There, there, the bullet in your body has restored some of your rationality, but look at you, you can't resist. Huh? She's a crazy bitch. Hey, Rochelle Gardner. Badum Here you go. Oh, we're gonna kill him? As long as you have that, you should both be even, even Steven, right? Now let's have a duel to the death. Whoever survives gets an even more lovely death. She's fucking crazy. What is the point of doing something like that? Silence, you boring brat. Why sick meaning? What do you think that will get you? There's no way that would ever amount to anything for a sinner. That's precisely why there's no need to seek meaning. Okay. Okay, now put on an entertaining show. Uh, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? What? What? No, don't kill her. Don't. No, no, no. No, please. Please, 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 please. Please, please don't, please. Oh my god. Shoot. Pew! It won't fire. And the show is over. You think I just hand over a loaded gun to some sinners? Sinners trying to commit more sin? That'll get you instant execution. We're dead? Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Don't. Could be that you're scared to pull the trigger. Can you not break away from that insipid, boring child? Don't. If you're gonna do it, make it quick. Don't. Even if you don't shoot, I can't resist killing you. Don't. Don't. I won't do it. I see. I'm fiending to kill. I'm sorry, making you kill someone as boring as me? Yeah, you're right. Probably make you feel shitty. Didn't I tell you that if you're gonna shoot, then do it? At this range, you won't miss. I won't shoot you. Haha, <laughs> don't you know what'll happen to you? Oh, that's right, you have the death wish. I do, but this isn't right. This is what is in my heart. Zack can kill me, but... That woman... Will not be a puppet for that woman. I won't. I mean, both you and I... Are not her playthings. Monica, stop this, Monica. Killing and being killed are both our decisions to make. Monica has to chill. Ha ha ha, after all this time, now you finally see something worthwhile. Gah, I can't hold back anymore. Hey, could you at least smile? Do it now. Hee hee hee. Man, you suck. That did look in your eyes. But yeah, if it was a genuine thing, I'd love it. Just imagining that I'm killing you puts a smile on my face. So much that I could even kill myself. You. Wait, is he dead? Zack. Ah? No way he's dead, no fucking way. 
absolutely horrifying. I take that back. You're not exemplary. Russian gardener and half baked sinner. You think that Isaac Foster is a social doll who ruled by desire? Oh, it silenced me so. Ah, this revelation will cast rain on my condemning parent. Rochelle, if you were any more doll, I'd die. I don't recall you being in charge of deciding that. Oh. I can get no joy from punishing you. Oh, it torments me, Rochelle. If it comes to this, then Zack would be good better, would be better, and he would've looked so good riddled with bullets too. If we can't pull a trigger, then you're nothing but a half baked sinner. So, why were you able to make it here? Oh well, it's rather boring, but you'll have to be riddled with bullets. And Zack is gonna kill her now, he's alive, what did I tell you? Oh my, you lived through that? Kill her, kill her, kill her, kill her, kill her, kill her, kill her. This can't be, you really are a monster that doesn't disappoint, how lovely. Would you kill Zack? Of course, I mean, I'm the only one who can punch such a lovely sinner, right? Stop it. Oh, go ahead and shoot. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but that gun was never loaded from the very stars. Well, I do know that. Well, it's not like it matters, a half picket sinner like you could never shoot in the first place. But I have to admit that I'd marry your spunk to turn the gun on me. Bang. What's happening? What's happening? Holy shit, is everybody dead? Alright, might as well punish him since his life's been prolonged and he's in prime form. Uh. Wait. Okay, flashbacks. No. What? No. What? 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 No. I want you to kill him. Zack is meant to kill me. <laughs> oh, where'd you get that handgun? Bang! Yes! Fucking yes! No, where'd you get that gun? Y you slut! So this is your sinful true self. She's 13, she's not a slut. That's great, you sinful girl. I'll punish you, I'll punish you. I'll punch the demon lurking underneath that collected face of yours. No, you won't. You won't do shit. Show it. And... Whoa! He cut her hand. Nice one. Huh? Stupid sadistic bitch, you've been shot, so don't look so happy. Thanks to you, I wanna kill, kill, and kill. He's bad boy. I'm up uh, and at him. You're kidding, right? This is reality, wake up. Nice. We can finally end this chapter. Ah, but he passed r away right out. Okay, what happened? Explain. Zack. Oh. Her arm and abdomen have been slashed. Ew. Fuck it, I'm gonna go away. Who cares about Zack? I gotta go see Zack first. Oh, okay. Let's see, Zack. Zack, are you alright? My stomach hurts like hell, da. Zack, earlier, did you take joy in slicing your own stomach? Huh? Don't get me confused with that sadistic bitch. I just figured it would be better than killing your boring ass and being killed by the bitch of a jailer. Did you see her face? Yeah. That was gold, haha. <laughs> you did me proud too. I feel like I'm a new man. Really? I got a bit of a flesh wound on my stomach, but it's nothing. You sure, bro? Alright, let's get going. Are you alright? Oh, pff, this ain't nothing. Okay, but know your limits. Put a cork in it, worry about yourself. We can finally get out, I can finally go to sleep. Let's do this, fucking let's do this. Oh no, you shitting on me? What an annoying bitch. Yeah. So, what's the plan? I'm not sure but the door might open if you operate the machine over there, yeah. 
Surveillance videos for each room, a video delivery system, a trap activation system, there it is, the door release button. I'm surprised that bitch was able to pull the strings from back so here so well. There's also an elevator passage button, I'll go ahead and open it. Open it, open it! Let's get the hell out of here! It's already open now, alright, let's go. Hmm, where does this go? Beats me. No, where? What's this? Is this the beginning place? It's the first area we passed through. What? Don't tell me that cocky beast been around here, right here or not. Whoa. Well, it doesn't really matter. This is warm food. I'm pretty sure this place had another an open door. I think it's for the elevator passage. Nice. What are we waiting around here for then? Let's put the pop cycle down. Stand. Uh, wait. We've got no further business with this room. When did we do in this room again? Took a picture. The only thing decent about this floor is pressing the button here. Then which room is it? This one? I think it's this one. What's written on here? The god give thy name and thou shalt be admitted entrance. If thou art free from this state, offer the name which resides within thee, and then know thyself, know this. God values not the corrupt. Okay. Hey, how long are you gonna be reading that? Is something interesting written down there? Uh, not especially. Huh? Well, why are you so serious while you read it? I'm sorry, don't worry about it. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. The elevator door is shut. It won't open. We come all this way in this. Hey, yeah. think I'll open with that button. Riddle machine from earlier. Pretty sure there wasn't an elevator boot switch on even on the control machine, let me think. Oh, I'll uh, let you do the thinking for both of us. This incident, come to think of it, the words bid thy name were written on the wall we saw earlier. Bid thy name, I'm pretty sure we have something with our names written on them. Yes, we have. Let's go, plus they're probably the perfect size to fit. Yeah. One for me and one for Zach. Uh, let's start with, uh, with Zach. It should have worked. Hey, don't you have one left over that way? It's left over. I'll throw this one away. You sure about that? Yeah. I don't think it's necessary. I think we made the good choice. Oh, it opened. We're getting on. Wait. We're finally done. Holy shit. This episode is going to be so super long, on fucking long. Hey Ray, you did a hell of a job there back there. Why the fuck is he talking like that? What do you mean? I mean, you did a hell of a job shooting that crazy bitch. Feels like a stream lore has been lifted off my shoulders. Okay, yeah. Hey Ray, so what brought you here in the first place? Oh. I witnessed the murder and came here for counseling. When I awoke, I was on the lowest floor of this building. Huh? That makes no sense. Tell me about it. Hmm. Oh, and the gun you fired, it wasn't that bitches, was it? What's the story on that? This is my gun. What the fuck? Where do you get your hands on something like that? Inside my handbag, wrapped in a handkerchief. I've had it ever since I witnessed the murder. Then, why didn't you just use it in the beginning? I will not kill myself. God would not forgive me. Nah, I didn't mean just that. Besides, you're the one who will kill me. I'm not sure if you're an idiot or smart. It's a smart girl. At any rate, what you did back there shooting that bitch was the right thing. It makes me blush just thinking about it. The timing was absolutely perfect. You're, you're in a good mood. You could say that. You too, right? Yeah, such a good mood. We're going to die, but such a good mood. Yeah, did we reach the other floor? We're here. Say hi. Knock on the door before entering. Is he dead? Zach? 
no, don't die, don't die. Zack? What? That's it? Well, that's it for the second episode. That's weird. So, the first episode of the game had like two floors. And now the second episode has one floor. I know why this video is super long now. Because like, this floor is just about like, I mean, this episode is just about one floor. So yeah. In the beginning of the let's play, we said one episode, I mean one uh, part for a third floor. So I guess I'll upload all the floor together. Those are some nice artworks. Bam! Ooh, badass. Badass girl. So the eyes are weird. To be continued. Yep, to be continued, guys. I don't know when, but to be continued. Whenever I feel like it. I should probably make a schedule, but... I don't know. <laughs> I'm not really good with schedules, so anyway. Uh, this video is long enough now, so... I hope you guys enjoyed this second uh, episode. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. And see you soon other videos. Bye, guys.